Welcome to my channel, The Spoiler Zone. Your ultimate destination for in-depth analysis and captivating breakdowns of your favorite film. Alert this video contains spoilers. I would recommend this movie to those who like comedy and drama. The Virginity Hit is a 2010 American found footage comedy film directed by Huck Botko and Andrew Gerland, produced by Adam McKay and Will Ferrell, and starring Matt Bennett, Zach Perlman, Jacob Davick, Justin Klein, and Nicole Weaver. The film itself is a series of videos on a teenager's attempt to lose his virginity, being recorded from cell phones to video cameras. Most of the cast use their own names for their characters. The movie starts with 4. Male teenage friends in New Orleans, Louisiana, Matt, Zach, Jacob, and Justin, buy a bong and agree to use it only to celebrate when one of the four has sex for the first time. The boys are beginning to lose their virginity and Matt is the last one. Matt is the adopted brother of Zach after Matt's mother died from cancer when he was nine. Matt's father had drug issues and only played a minor role in his life. Matt has been with his girlfriend Nicole for almost two years and the two decide to lose their virginity together on their second anniversary. Zach decides to videotape the entire process to make his own documentary-type film. As Matt prepares for the big night, he discovers that Nicole has cheated on him with a college fraternity member, Harry. Zach goes to find Harry to confirm if it is true, but he refuses to answer. Matt and the guys assume she did in fact have sex with Harry and the plan for the big night is soon altered. Zack decides the best thing for Matt to do is still have sex with Nicole but break up with her immediately afterwards. He feels this would be great for the documentary he is making. Matt and his friends set up a date for Matt at a hotel, but when Nicole realizes they are being filmed and recorded from the adjoining room, she becomes angry at Matt and admits she did not go very far sexually with Harry. She claims he had only sucked on her breasts. Nicole's father then comes and takes Nicole away from Matt and then pushes Matt into a bush after he breaks up with her. The entire segment on the failed date soon becomes popular on YouTube. A young woman, Becca, sees the video and claims that she feels bad for Matt. She leaves a video response letting him know she is experienced and would love to be his first. Becca's first requirement for the date is that Matt buys a very expensive suit. Matt is then reminded by Zach that his mother left him a large amount of money and convinces Matt to withdraw it for the suit. Matt then learns that his father withdrew the money when he was younger and the funds are not available. Angered by this, Matt decides to confront his father about it. After doing so, he learns his father has no desire to pay him back and claims the money was used for drugs. The boys and Krista, Zach's sister and Matt's other adopted sibling, get drunk in camp. During this time, Krista unsuccessfully tries to have sex with Matt. When the boys return home, they come up with a plot to steal the suit, which is successful. Matt finally meets Becca and she tells him that she has a son. They then plan the date and as she is leaving, hands Matt a note that lets him know he needs to be shaven in all parts of his body, including his pubic region. Preparing for the date, Zach ends up shaving Matt's pubic region for him. When Matt arrives at Becca's residence, he is told by Becca that the cameras cannot stay in film and that he must practice sex on a blow-up doll, which has an inflatable penis as well. Instructed by Becca, Matt uses the doll's penis in place of the vagina. Becca then leaves for nearly three hours before Matt leaves. The film then shows Becca on a video blog admitting her name is not Becca and that she is actually a graduate student studying male behavior and notes that he waited over twice as long as any other male had in the past. She also admits that her child was not hers, but someone else that she used for her studies. The video of him with the blow-up doll becomes a huge YouTube success and ends up leaving Matt ashamed and embarrassed, 
leading to him staying in his room for two weeks. In an effort to get Matt out of his funk, the boys come up with a plan for Matt to have sex with his favorite porn star, Sonny Leone. They contact her and she agrees as long as the funds are paid. The boys and others raise the funds and then come up with a plan for Jacob is go into the military to be able to get Matt out of the house. They go to a strip club and meet Sunny and then go out to her bus so Matt may have sex with her. On the bus, Sunny lets Matt know that she has changed her mind and says that he should find someone he loves to have sex with. He then requests to spend five minutes alone with her, which is granted. After a few minutes, Matt emerges from her bedroom and Sunny can be seen putting her shirt back on. He sucked on her breasts to even out what Nicole did to him. He then finds Nicole at a party, explains what he did, and the two have sex. The boys use the bong to celebrate Matt losing his virginity. What I understand from the movie is that The Virginity Hit is a raunchy comedy that offers a humorous take on the coming-of-age experience, albeit with mixed reactions regarding its portrayal of teenage sexuality. Subscribe and comment for more videos like this and thank you for watching.